with a look at one of the busiest nights of the year for cab drivers. Yeah, and that includes increasingly popular ride-sharing services like Uber. News 6 reporter Justin Wormuth is in downtown Orlando tonight. He joins us live now. And Justin, the cost to get a ride is going to be much higher than usual tonight. Yeah, that's right, Ginger, especially around peak hours when everyone's trying to get home safely. It's called surge pricing, and it basically means that your ride home tonight could cost you up to six times the normal price. We spent the day with one of many drivers from Uber who will be hitting the roads tonight. Take a look. It's one of the busiest nights of the year. Yes, it is. Meet Quinn Kitt. Quinn has been driving for Uber, the ride-sharing service, for more than a year. And obviously tonight, she and many of her colleagues have the task of getting those ringing in the new year with alcohol home safely. It's not worth the risk. If you know you're going to go out and drink heavily, which a lot of people are tonight, why take the risk? We will literally, literally be out all night long. Last New Year's Eve, Uber was under fire for their surge pricing, spiking the cost of a ride by more than six times the normal price during peak hours midnight until 3 a.m. and you can expect the same this year. With surge pricing, the best thing for that is to share the ride. If it's surge pricing is really very expensive, you can split the fare if it's more than one person. So it's not just all on one person. Uber's competitor Lyft also uses surge pricing, which the company calls prime time, but caps it at 200 percent. Taxis, however, have a set price, a price Quinn says isn't worth the uncertainty. You can see us on the, on your map, on your phone. You know how long it'll take for us to get there. I mean, versus calling a cab, where you call for a cab and they'll say, "Oh, we'll send one out there whenever we can." You don't know when the car is going to be there. With Uber, you know when we're going to be there. So why, once again, why take the risk? At the end of the day, or in this case, night, it's always best to have a way to get home safely if you've been drinking. A lot of people tell me that it's just not worth the risk to go out when you know you're going to be drinking, go out, maybe get pulled over or anything like that. But that's what we're here for. We are here to get you home safely. And a live look here at Wall Street Plaza in downtown Orlando. Folks are coming and going, watching some of the big college football bowl games on TV. Now, Uber drivers and taxi drivers are not the only ones who are going to be busy tonight. Law enforcement will also have their hands full. We'll have that part of the story coming up for you tonight at 6. Ginger. All Justin, right. Justin Wormuth reporting live from downtown Orlando. Thank you.